Hello everyone! Do you guys remember how everyone and their mother was complaining how Split is a really bad map? Well now, you can bring it back, because Split from the next week is gonna be back in the competitive queue. But it did go under some changes. It has some changes in the way that you can approach the map as attackers. I already have seen people complain, oh I expected more man, this took six months, oh my god. But those changes are actually pretty big and I'm gonna tell you why. So let's just just jump into the server on the map and just straight from the bat when you're attacking a site there's a huge change over here to the first area that you go into the map this runway was non-existent before there was a wall that was just this wall was starting at this point what does this change well you might think eh, not much actually right it's uh, it's wider so you have a bit better access to the exit of a main for the uh, attackers if someone over peaks from defense and that's always happening by the way in rank there's a reina peaking this and dying first tempo and then you, everyone else is doing this um but it does change a lot for attacking ramp because the ramp defender is gonna have a harder time on holding the cr the crosser placement here correctly. Now, when you think about it, if there's if there's this old split, there's no runway over here. So when you're holding the operator angle like this, there's like 95% chance that wherever someone is peeking, you don't have to move your mouse because you're just gonna hit him. With this addition of the runway here. There can be a model just running out. And you're gonna hit him in the leg unless you flick. So this essentially makes it uh, more difficult for the defender to have a correct placement, specifically with a rifle, right? Because if you're playing with a rifle over here, it's so hard to to hit someone in the head when they are swinging with multiple corners. If there's gonna be one player on runway and one player on here, they can wide swing together as two players and there's no, absolutely no way you're gonna stop it so that's very important change for attacking the ramp area and since we talk about ramp let's assume we're attacking to this site there's already a huge sorry not site to heaven there's a huge change over here if you guys remember there was a big staircase over here that is not existent anymore and it's moved into a different direction now this changes a lot because before when you were attacking the from ramp onto heaven, you had your you had your crosser placement like here. That was the head level for the defenders standing on heaven. Right now it's unified. You can have your crosser placement way higher, and it's gonna be unified for almost every exit because people playing in this position are gonna be on a similar head he head height like the players in the back which makes it a huge change and there's also no bin here that you can jump on and stand above the box which is another huge change and it gives a slight edge towards the attackers so that's a big one but boy oh boy do i have a big thing for a side there's no more two angles that you have to check on your left side only one when you're attacking now a side you don't have to guess is there someone on the top or on the bottom, or maybe both, because there's only one angle that you have to check, so mollying this will actually make it certain for you. So if you are a character that has a molly, a painter or something, bounce it from this box, and by the way, this box is way higher, so it's also easier to do that, but also easier to hide behind it, you're able to clear this entire left corner with just one piece of utility. Unless, of course, you're a Viper and you're gonna maxim maximum do 132 damage, so you still have to look left like a jackass. And that's why I was always saying that Viper nerve on the mollies is too big and it makes it impossible to use on attack. So, that's a very big change on the site. And now let's go to mid. On mid, there's a small change that you probably will never notice unless someone will tell you that something could change. Can you guess what? Of course not, because I almost didn't see it when I was seeing the comparisons. What if you don't have a comparison? Right here, this ledge just got deleted. There's no ledge. There's just nothing here. And we used this small ledge to do a crouch jump over this box so you could stand over it and just essentially go over a sage wall if you had the opportunity to do so. Now, that is not possible and it makes it a little bit easier on the movement because you're not getting fucked by going up and down because there's a small ledge over here. Now, when it comes to B-side, not many changes were done, but there's some small changes done towards male. 
and they affect both male and B main. Well, uh, let me explain. So there was a trash can over here. No, no, not Reyna. There was a trash can over here in this spot that got exchanged for a broom. So now you're able to stand in this corner and you have a little bit of more room. It doesn't change much. Because you you can't really crouch over here in this corner because your leg is going to be visible. So please don't crouch here. And if you're a sage, jet or neon, you should definitely not stand over here because your hair is sticking out. So I don't think it's a big change, but it gives you a little bit of space. So that's one thing. But the bigger change is actually this angle. Before, this wall, if I'm not mistaken, was on this line right here. So you had a hard hard 90 um, degree angle maybe or maybe here it doesn't matter but you had a, a hard 90 degree angle that wasn't really nice to look at or play with when it comes to up your defender's position right but now you're able to have a better understanding of a push on b side because you're able to to just go in this corner and have a cross to 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 the side without being exposed fully to the exit as well at the same time like before so this is actually a beneficial change for the defenders unless of course your opponents already have control over heaven uh but yeah if that's happening well then you shouldn't be standing in the first place anyway those are all small uh, small changes um on, on the b side and on the mid but in general in professional play in my eyes split was already um attackers based attackers um let's say favorable not by a big margin but it was like 52 to 48 for the for the attackers and it was completely swapped towards ranked in ranked this felt worse than attacking on on ascent and ascent is horrible when it comes to attacking so this is gonna help a little bit not much but a little bit for pro play this might actually be even a uh, bigger change uh than you uh, what we have seen on other maps in the past so i really like what the devs did here i don't think there was a lot of changes needed people were going in for like oh we need another entrance yeah another entrance is needed for c side on 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 lotus that side c has its c in its name because it's a clusterfuck but split is a little bit different and i'll, I'll give it a go we'll see how it goes I think uh, uh, um, Split is now a little bit interesting to play. And we're going to see each other in the next Lotus Lab episode once we're going to get more games on Ranked with the new Lotus and Split. And I'll give you an info. Am I correct? Am I incorrect? No, I'm never incorrect. Anyway, thank you for watching. See you